Hey Hellhounds, welcome back to the channel. Today I am going to show you how to turn your Logitech C920 from looking like this. To looking like this. Basically, it's a huge drastic difference, right? I mean, don't get me wrong, the Logitech C920 is a very good budget camera and I've been using it ever since I started creating videos, ever since I started streaming on Facebook, even before I switched over to Twitch. By the way, go check me out on twitch.tv slash Husky. You might like what you see. <laughs> Anyways, the first time I ever got the Logitech C920 and I plugged it in, it had this. It looked like this. This is how it looked like and I actually already liked it. I already liked how it looked like and I said this is actually a really good looking camera as is. But, but I never really saw the true potential I, until I started fidgeting around OBS to figure out, hey, maybe I can actually make it look better. So if you want to make your Logitech C920 look better on meetings, on everything, you guys can actually do that now on OBS because OBS has virtual camera and it's very straightforward. And I don't think I need to teach it, but if I do, just let me know in the comment section below and I'll create a video on it on how to turn your OBS into your webcam. You know how to use it as your webcam. Right now, I'm going to teach you how to turn it into this. Okay. Very simple. Yeah, it could use a lot of tweaking, a lot more of anything. But personal preference wise, this is what I want it to look like. And I already like it the way it is. So I'm going to show you guys how to do it exactly. Okay. So I'm going to turn off everything that I have. And you guys are going to see it based how my camera is would be like base wise okay okay so this is how it looks like when you plug it in everything on default everything has auto set you actually can see i am a little bit laggy and like i don't know i'm losing frames or whatever that that's how it looks like it's too bright it's too it's too whatever actually the auto isn't actually that bad but you know it can get laggy when it adjusts when it does its own thing and that's how that's what we're going to be trying to address right now so i'm going to show you guys my desktop so basically, this is my OBS, and yes, I use Stream Elements. I do highly recommend that you guys try it and use Stream Elements. It's very much easier to use than, you know, others. So this is OBS. You, double, you go to your webcam, for example. You open this part of your webcam. You open this part of your webcam. You know, double-click your webcam and your sources. In your sources, double-click your webcam. Click on Configure Video. It should pop this open, this little window. Which is gonna help us greatly and everything go through everything video proc amp and camera control go through everything and uncheck uncheck all of those that uh, that is on auto and make sure you uncheck low light compensation as well i'm doing this because i have controlled lighting but if you don't have controlled lighting and you feel like your lighting is going to be changing all throughout your stream then i do suggest you keep it checked but again you're going to have this weird laggy looking thing so the first thing you do is you set it to the way you want. If you notice, nothing changed yet, right? All you have to do is click OK, click Deactivate on your webcam. It's going to deactivate it, make it reset, and there you go. First of all, I'm somewhat much smoother. It's not a 60 FPS, but it simulates and looks like and makes it somewhat feel like a 60 FPS. It's really not a 60 FPS, but it's much smoother with than with the low light compensation on. That is for sure now adjust whatever you need to adjust to make it you know feel like what you want to and i adjust my gain to what i want to see so i'm going to move this to my second screen because my monitor the main monitor that you guys are that i'm working on right now is actually darker so i move it here click apply click ok and that's already set so now what is the next thing to do how do i make my camera look much better i'm going to move this on to the top right right now so this is how it looks like right now the next thing you need to do is right click on your webcam in your sources click on filters and add a color correction it's much simple why because i just do this and it's going to be much more colorful now what do i what do you do from here on out what you what you do is you adjust it adjust this setting to your liking do you think i'm too saturated then it will desaturate it a bit do you think i have too much contrast well okay we'll lower that a bit too much gamma maybe we'll lessen it and just like that, your camera looks much better. And if you guys still don't see it, I'm going to show you guys one more time. But without putting my uh, webcam settings back to the default, basically it came from this to this. We're basically adding life to your C920. 
and your adding smoothness so please go double check your settings again just remember if you guys a uh, quick recap is you double click this configure video that's where everything is don't forget to hit apply you don't hit, up, hit apply it nothing happens you're gonna have to reset your set your settings again okay so don't forget that and then hit okay don't just hit the x button just, just make sure you do everything right i hope this simple tutorial helps you with your c920 and you now have an idea on how to make it look like the way you want it to look like add some life to your webcam and I, I'm pretty sure, I'm not sure, I've never tried another webcam, but I'm pretty sure you can do this, a similar thing to other webcams on OBS to make them look better. So do try it out. Let me know in the comment section below if it worked for you, if you're using another webcam, if you're having troubles with your C920 and doing whatever it is I showed you, let me know in the comment section below. I'd love to help you out. I'd love to figure your problem out and I'd love to make your webcam have life. Again, I'm Hellish. If you guys didn't know, I stream almost every day on twitch so you guys can go to twitch.tv slash hellish husky you guys can ask me live uh if you guys have questions about the c920 about setting up obs about whatever you need about your streaming needs i'd love to help you out no problem i'm here for you all the way thank you so much for watching if you haven't liked this video hit that like button especially if it helped you out even just a little bit don't forget to hit that sub button if you're not subscribed yet to catch future videos on the random shit that i do I appreciate you. I really do. Stay happy. Stay safe. Choose happiness. Please be kind to one another. Bye.